Hello friends, here we will make a trumpeting elephant. You can see how it trumpets. We will need a square paper. We will give a triangular fold with color inside. We will open it, bring the edge to the diagonal line. So we make a kite fold bringing both the sides to the central line. We have now made the kite fold. We will open it, bring the outer edge to this fold line. It's actually a 22 and a half degrees fold. We will do the same on the other side. Bringing it to the 22 and a half degrees. Now fold it over that on both sides. Once you have done that, crease the folds well. and fold the whole thing on the diagonal line backwards. We will now find the midpoint by bringing the two corners together. So that pinch is the midpoint. From there, we will fold it backwards Push that back from the pinch mark and you will form an L. Now this part, make sure all the points meet, the folds meet in that corner. So basically you have formed an L out there, a 90 degrees. Now we will fold this whole thing downwards like this in this angle and give it a press now we will open it and we will give a reverse fold pushing that part inside and folding the front downwards and we close it So that's a reverse fold. Now we do the same thing down, a reverse fold again, fold that there and lift it up and press it down there forming a reverse like that. You can see the elephant taking shape already. Now, this white part, we will fold it and we will tuck it inside there. We will push it inside that pocket. So fold it along that white strip, press it, lift the blue part and push the white part inside. So we get a nice slender trunk. Now the back, when you open this part, you will see this blue and white line. Fold that along that line, inside. Same thing on the other side. When you open it, fold it along that blue and white line. Now we will form the back. So bring the tail to that corner and press it. Give it a fold out there. Now we will open it and squash fold it. Forming into a square. Now that square that has formed 
that square we will make an A fold from that line so bring the two edges to the central line on both sides like how we make a bird we will make a bird base now so we will open that lift that part and fold it like a boat you can see the boat being formed and then press it along the creased lines on both sides you will do that so now you have found something like a rhombus or a diamond and you will fold it over that now the tail you will just fold it down like how you make a bird's beak so that is the tail of the elephant formed and you can fiddle around and turn the trunk and give it a shape out there so that's your elephant you can hold this part there and the back you can pull it and you will see the elephant trumpeting I hope you enjoyed making the elephant you can put your eyes for more videos please subscribe to more is fun to learn have a nice day enjoy the trumpeting elephant <laughs>